Hi guys, fourth episode in making cars from this Oral-B mouthwash bottle. We did the mouse trap, we did the electric fan, and we just did the rubber band powered one. So now on my list it says gravity. So I've got a old lead fishing weight. I've got some more bamboo canes and I've 3D printed uh, a pulley and a bracket to hold it in at the top of the um, tower or tripod. Well, it can't be a tripod because it's four legs. But the idea is we'll get All of these, doesn't matter if they're a bit bowed this time, poke holes through the plastic and use this to hold the top end. I'm going to have to glue them in. I've made them a loose fit. So that will... Oh, I'll have to move the camera. Hang on. That's better. Um, yeah, they'll... I still can't quite see the top. These will poke into the top of the plastic. That will hold the top of it. Hold the four um, bamboo canes together. And then this pulley uh, with a bit of bicycle spoke to go through it. I'll cut that shorter, but that should do for putting the bit of string over or I'll use um, kite string. I haven't made a very deep groove in it but hopefully that'll do just to get the job done. So that's what I'm going to do. Push four holes in, assemble this and we'll see if it works. Still using the rest of the car as it was. So it's still the four CDs for the wheels, bamboo canes or barbecue skewers for the axles. The back one's already got a little peg on it or hook, which is just the end of the barbecue skewer super glued onto the axle so we can hook the uh, string on it. These CDs, I've got my 3D printed hubs in the middle to put the barbecue skewers through, but you could just easily use a couple of plastic bottle caps glued either side and put the barbecue skewer through the middle of that, or even just pieces of thick cardboard either side. It's just something to fill up the hole in the middle of the CD that will grip the barbecue skewers. Anyway, I will use my pointy implement, it's a braddle, to push some holes in. Push the holes in, four of them. I took the wheels off so it was easier to do. Oh, these wheels have got rubber tyres on them. Link in the video description to show you how to do that. I'll just put that one on backwards, not that it matters. but. That gives the wheels extra grip, so we don't get wheel spin. Need just a little bit of a gap. Yep. Yeah. Right, let's just have a look, see if we've got four of these the same size. Quite often you get quite a variation. Some, some of them are thicker. Usually they're the same length, which I suppose is positive. Yeah, they all look the same length. And I will need to either glue them in there or put a bit of tape around the end to make them a tighter fit, because I've made them a little bit loose.
Yeah, those will go in those holes. I'll sort that out and then we'll see if it works. We might be lucky and get away without gluing these on the top because there's quite a bit of tension where they're being forced in. They may hold themselves in place. But I do need to shorten that. That's a bit too long. Right, lead weight. When that hits there, it could cause a problem. It depends how fast it falls down. Bearing in mind, it should be dropping fairly slowly because it will drop at the same rate as the car's moving along. But we do need a bit of string that's going to go all the way up there and all the way down there. Right, I've got some kite string here. That should be strong enough to hold the lead weight. doesn't have to be a fishing weight, you just need a, a reasonable weight. I think this particular one is about 5 ounces. that for length. Needs to go over that hook. And once we wind it up, that will lift the weight. it go that should drive the car forwards and it should drop off the axle so it can freewheel Bit of wires coming out. Right, ready to go. Try and point it in the right direction. Off we go. whole distance and we've still got a tiny bit left. Let's see if we can go the other way.
Uh, away we go. Excellent. Well, it works. So that's our gravity powered Oral B mouthwash bottle. Four CDs. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six barbecue skewers. A bit of um, kite string I've used, strong cotton would do. My 3D printed hubs for the CDs uh, and we've also got rubber tires on the back wheels we probably didn't need them for this build and a lead weight and my 3d printed uh, bracket or attachment at the top there to hold the pulley and a little bit of bicycle spoke two millimeter wire it's all we really needed, it just happens to be bicycle spoke. And that works. Thanks for watching. If you want more information, check down below in the video description. If you like this video, you might like this one up here. And if you want to subscribe, you can check out my channel over here. Up here is my latest video on my channel. And down here is a video playlist associated with the video you've just watched. Thanks again for watching.